ProWrestlingSheet.com. It was weird to be told in this promo and multiple times throughout the show that the show you've been watching has sucked. Yeah. Even if you haven't said any, we've been saying it, even if everyone's been saying it while watching, yeah. it's weird to tune into a show and have them say, like, yeah, we know the show sucked lately. Here's, And we're going to point out all the reasons you've said it. Um, especially because I have a hard time believing that they're making actual changes. I feel like more yeah. it was with the heat factor, you know, to get to, you know, they were building up heat to, to you know, to be to allow Rollins to do something like this because I had heard from people that they were aware of what they were doing in the past couple weeks. Like I kind of yeah. said on here, yeah. that they were aware of what they were doing in the past couple weeks. They were trying to piss everyone off. Um, so, yeah, you know, I, I it was odd. To have that happen, yeah. first and foremost. But beyond that, it was a cool moment. I mean, it was a cool yeah. opening segment. It was, it was like, it was very much like a, you know, you said the p- pipe bomb, and it's not so much a pipe bomb, but you know, when he like when he mentioned uh, the revival, it was very yeah. reminiscent of when it was like, hi, Colt Cabana, and the, you know, even though Colt Cabana didn't work on the company at the time, and right. the, re- the revival does, uh, it had that same kind of vibe to it. So I, yeah, I, I liked it a lot. Um, I mean, don't you think it was kind of weird though to have like the main person? Yes, like, right. Because you wouldn't see that like if you're like, like I'm trying to think of like what it would be comparable to. Like, it's hard because there's not really a lot of shows mm-hmm. that are comparable to wrestling yeah, in, yeah. in terms of like blending reality with I, fiction. I think it'd be Aaron Rodgers or Tom Brady coming out going, "Why is Kaepernick not here in the league? What is this all about? Roger Goodell's taking forty million dollars a year. What is he doing? Roger, you're an idiot. Like well, at, in that, at a at a state of the union but, NFL but, situation. But the difference is that this is scripted. Right, 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 right. So, so like, yeah, the, the, okay, fair. I think that's the difference to me yeah. is that like, if if that were to happen, it would be a genuine moment of like someone venting their frustration right. to let it be known they that's support what Colin to, Kaepernick. S- similarly, totally. Right, right. But it's interesting to me that like yeah, they, scripted they, they, to do I'm it. trying to think of like a mm. scripted environment where they would script themselves to say the. Per show they've produced the past couple weeks has sucked. You it's know, if, if maybe Christian would give the outlaw a chance to complain about the showdown, <laughs> uh, like to really complain about this. And Christian told me what to say, complaining about his own product. I that it would be so. a sin. It would be similar to that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. totally. Yeah. Yeah. But like, oh, I almost picture it being like a soap opera or whatever. Yeah. But yeah. even though soap opera doesn't really blend reality with fiction, so it's kind. Of, I guess it's more like a reality show coming out, like like the Jersey Shore coming on TV and Snooki being like, man. Past two weeks of Jersey Shore really f- sucked. Yeah, you know, like yeah. you'd be like, "That's jarring." You yeah. know, like I've watched the past couple weeks and I think it sucks, but you shouldn't think it sucks. Right. It's your show. Yeah. You know, so the ratings are down. No one's watching our show. Yeah, it was. It was, and like you said, it, it was. It was very meta mm-hmm. to have Vince script a character. Yeah. To complain about the things that he himself has written, Vince has written. Yeah. But direct it at another character on the show. That's a weird. Like, imagine Vince sitting there writing that. Like, yeah. writing someone complaint, writing down everyone's complaints about his own script. That's a that's a weird scenario. Oh, like, yeah. it's, I feel like that's one of those like only in wrestling type things. Yeah, thoroughly weird, thoroughly insane. But I also think, ironically, I think it accomplished two things in this. This was maybe the best Corbin's ever been. Agreed. Back and forth on a promo. And second, I think they're setting up uh, Rollins now to go for the main strap. I, I think they think are too. That was, uh, that. was This is why you leave him out there that long before anyone shows up. You let the public like really enjoy him and savor him. Then you have him say what the public's been thinking about saying, the voice of the people in that way and against Corbin. And so now Corbin's going to put him through hell a la Vincent Stone Cold again. We've seen this numerous, we've seen this little storyline play out a million times. And then eventually he's going to be in a situation where he's going to win the, the main title. And he may lose the IC title in the process, but that's because he's being set up to win the main title. So. Uh,